This is CNC World, a new perspective. London will see in the new year with the world's first multi-sensory fireworks display. The show on New Year's Eve will bring not only explosions of light and color, but also fruity smells and tastes. Lifestyles has more. Peach snow, banana confetti, and zesty orange baubles. That's what food scientists Bompas and Parr will bring to the New Year's Eve display for those gathered on the banks of the Thames. It's one of the highlights of London's New Year's Eve fireworks display this year. The two scientists are going to make South Bank smell and taste as sweet as a feud of strawberries. See the display, hear the display, but actually this year they'll be able to taste it. So when, this, when the sky goes red, they'll be able to uh, smell strawberries. So it's really good fun. Some other special effects that they'll see as we go through the, through the display, just really to give the, um, give the audience another experience. The Jack Morton Company has produced the UK Capital's annual fireworks display for 10 years now. It's estimated that a quarter of a million people will gather along the banks of the Thames to watch. The figures are astounding. There will be 12,000 fireworks, which will produce 50,000 projectiles. The three fireworks barges will carry 30 tons of equipment. Really, they've had you know, a very special night. They've experienced something that only could happen in London, something that is um, sort of unique, and um, you know, really just uh, make sure that they're all going home safely with you know, a big smile on their face. What's more, the first London New Year's Eve fireworks app will be made available 24 hours before the new year, allowing people from all over the world to watch at the same time. According to the Mayor of London, international visitor numbers to London are at a record high as the capital continues to bask in a post-Olympic glow that saw 7.9 million tourists visit London in the first six months of this year. This is CNC World. A new perspective.